Hello, thank you for joining us on Community Connection. I'm your host, Tracy Christensen. For the past few years, Brigham Young University and Utah Valley University have combined their efforts in a successful food drive that benefits our community. November is the time of year when hunger is keenly felt, and once again, these universities are working to provide food for those in need. Today, I'm joined by Kiana Schaefer of UVU and Cecily Palmer from BYU, who are here to tell us about Valley United Against Hunger. Thank you very much for being here. Thanks for having us. So it's kind of a unique situation for the two universities <laughs> to combine efforts. Mm -hmm. It is, yes. It's great. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and tell us how it's all gonna work. So we are both doing separate events, um, but are going to be combining forces with community action services to really help people in the community here in the Valley. Yeah. That's awesome. So is it a competition? It's a friendly competition, yes. <laughs> but all, uh, all, the, all the donations go to community action, so it's a combined effort. Mm -hmm. And tell us a little bit about community action services and how they, they help. Yeah. Community Action Service is an incredible organization that really tries to help people meet their basic needs and then will try to help these families become independent financially and um, succeeding in society. So they're not only just giving people a hand out, right. but a hand up. Really helping them to become self-reliant. But yes. this is the time of year when when Definitely. people need a little bit of extra food sometimes. Yeah, yes. and every dollar that we raise equals five pounds of food, which can feed a family of four for one day. So it's huge. Which is amazing because mm -hmm. a dollar isn't a lot no, for people to donate. Not. Especially for college students, so. Yeah, and so that really makes a big difference. So why don't you each tell about your event and how people can donate if they want to donate to the Cougars or their Wolverines. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, there's going to be some great events happening. At BYU, we're going the first event is really going to be a basketball game between UVU and BYU on November 13th, where we will have booths um, that people can come and donate there. Awesome. An easy dollar makes a big difference, and there will be discount coupons for the next week's Fresno State game. Um, Great. That's one of the activities, and then they're going... Dining Services, BYU Dining Services has really helped BYU in years past with doing a cupcake mural and doing the longest cougar tail, and they donate all of the food. And this year, um, on November 11th, they're going to be doing another Cosmo cupcake mural to help with that the food drive. That sounds fun. Oh yeah. And tasty. <laughs> Very, it's great, great for all students. Um, and then on, during the week, we're going to be having students go out to different apartment complexes around BYU to ask students if they would like to donate a can or um, any food. Things. Okay, wonderful. Uh -huh. Yeah. And how about at UVU? Yeah, at UVU, um, we're having a kickoff event that's um, October 28th, 29th, 30th. It, it's going to be a haunted house, and it's called Scared for Good. This is the second year we've done it, and all the money that we raise from this haunted house goes to Valley United. Um, so that's our first event. And then, um, like she said, the game that's coming up, we're super excited. And then uh, November 18th, we're also premiering um, the Hunger Games Part 2 at University Mall. So students can buy tickets um, and go see the movie the day bo before it comes out. Awesome. That's, yeah. That is great. You are doing a wonderful job planning and executing these activities, and good job for what you're doing because we do have need in our community. Definitely. Will you each remind us of your websites so that people can go there and donate and support? Oh yeah, definitely, uh, alumni.byu.edu. And uvualumni.org, you can find. Excellent, wow. Cecily and Kiana, thanks for being with us. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck. Thanks. By working together, the students at the two universities in Utah Valley will help make this Thanksgiving a holiday to remember for many families. To find out how you can help in this and other worthy activities around our state, please visit kbyu11.org. Thanks so much for being with us and please join us again on Community Connection.